So today, DC released a new look at their movies, and I'm not going to lie, they got me a little excited, low-key. You know, The Rock's looking like a milk dud, and um, <clears throat> no, all jokes aside, I mean, it, it kind of looks cool, but I don't really care because it's DC. DC is trash, and I'm kind of over them. Like, they've they've messed up things so much to the point where I'm just like, I don't care. Like the, I think the only DC project you will care to see is the Batman. I'm already kind of over it. Really? Like, I've seen some scenes, and I'm just like... I think he's gonna maybe. be the best. I'm, Batman. Like, I'm gonna like, I'm gonna watch it, and we'll see. But at, at the end of the day, right now, Christian Bale's my top Batman. For now. So I don't think that they're gonna rival it. I really don't. Especially since they're gonna throw this Batman away in like three seconds because they have another Batman. No. Yeah. No, no, they're not throwing him away. So he's gonna be the actual new Batman in canon. Not in canon. Matt Reeves specifically said, "If you don't give me like a separate universe, I'm walking away." And they're like, "Fine, we're gonna let you do that." And Matt Reeves is signed. That's oh, not why throwing it away. DC is garbage. Thank you. <laughs> but no, but Rap- Reeves aside for a trilogy, and there's like three spinoffs. Oh, look, I'm j- I'm saying I just don't I don't care. Like if they're gonna be doing all this stuff, you're like supposed to be focusing on canon, but you're like, well, because we wanted to appease this one director, and we really didn't want to go with his version of Batman. He's gonna get a whole different universe, a whole different Batman. It's like, honestly, if I was the the head of that studio, I would have just like played upon. Uh, Christian Bale's Batman and had him be like an old guy transitioning to a new, like transitioning a new Batman. Yeah, that's why they brought back Keaton. That's literally what they're doing. But I'm saying that I would have loved to have seen like Christian Bale like hand the torch over and like some of the characters like Anne Hathaway. Oh, okay. You You mean specifically Bale? Yes. Okay. Gotcha, gotcha. Because I mean, they tried to get him for BVS, but he was like more money. (laughs) <laughs> and they're like, he is a good actor. He is a <laughs> fantastic actor. But uh, this, you know, this Batman movie is three hours long. I think it can top. I think it'll top it. I think it's gonna be terrible. Damn, that's a shame. We disagree on that. We'll see. We'll check back in when we, afterwards. But you know, The Rock looked f-ing buffish and was an absolute f-ing unit. I'm surprised they, I really hope they honestly play his song in the Black Adam movie. It's about drive, it's about power. We stay hungry, we do our play in the work, put in the hours and take what's ours. Oh, that's literally, hey man, I'm interested to see The Rock as a superhero, but that suit did not, I don't think it matched his skin color. I was like, it's a little. No, it's, that's actually pretty much pulled from the comics. Yeah, and I'm good on it. I, I think the I Rock, think if this movie does well, we can actually see the reintroduction of Superman Cavill specifically. There's no reason for them to... The re- Rock could have played Thanos, bro. F*** me. <laughs> he could have been a freaking black Thanos, bro. He's freaking big as it is. I don't know. But comment down below what you guys think. We'll see you next time. Peace. Peace.